would you looky, 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 looky there. Uncle Bull Cow Breakfast with the bowl. You know what time it is. 98.3 on your FM dial. W-B-U-L-L radio. Look at that bad boy. <clears throat> we'll talk about that in a minute. We'll, we'll, we'll start out with something a little milder since my tolerance is low. I know what you're thinking. Oh, this is hot to me right now. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Uncle Bokow, your tolerance is always low. Y yes. My tolerance to peppers is. My tolerance to BS. I usually have a pretty high tolerance. I usually can put up with quite a bit before I snap. Um, I'm not gonna snap. Um, but boy, the past week, I had a falling out with a friend, <clears throat> you know, whatever, um, last week, but there was two other things that happened. One of those things is still consider can can uh, I don't know what I was gonna say. Still happening, but uh, I'm gonna tighten my circle up. Even tighter. I don't know what it is, but I got a few more followers on social media. <clears throat> Instagram and you know YouTube and stuff and it's like more peppers more problems um, yeah people told me it would be like this but it's not not all that it's it's got people doing some shady stuff that I do business with and uh, I'm not gonna put up with it With that being said, some of the decisions that I'm about to make are going to cost me a lot of money. But they are going to relieve me of a lot of headaches. <clears throat> um, just, yeah. Somebody <clears throat> somebody thinks they're, uh, they're, they're smarter than me. They think that they're playing me when they're really playing themselves. Anyway, this is, this is, I was just explaining on my tolerance as well. I'm not going to put up with only so many lies and so many, uh, the scams and the, the shady stuff. <clears throat> um, no, not, not the bull. So what this is, <coughs> it's a creamsicle ghost scorpion that threw red pods, okay? It's probably hotter than the Dickens. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's super hot. It's floral. I'm not getting any bitter notes yet. I'm not I'm down in the placenta. But when you know when you're when it's floral and you're not in the placenta yet, but that placenta is gonna be floral as all heck. <clears throat> so yeah, it's a red creamsicle ghost scorpion. <clears throat> I showed some people on Instagram last night, and I said, what do we got here? A strawberries and cream, creamsicle ghost scorpion, or strawberries and cream ghost scorpion. And then I said, um, I said right on there, I'm only joking, so. I 
Although I know some people that would go ahead and rename it that and claim that it was their cross. Um, I'm not going to do that. You know, people, <clears throat> I don't think a lot of people worry about their reputation. They're just out to make quick money in the, in the now. And, uh, trying to get their name out there and, be, and sound, sound important and famous. Uh, I'm not with that. I built my channel slowly. And I have kept a tight-knit group of friends. Don't get me wrong. You're going to have friends that you're going to have differences with and sometimes even a falling out with. But business partners, all kinds of stuff. Anything, when you get in this game, it's just, that's what it is. Um, no doubt, but... You're going to run into some, some headaches. And regardless of what, I've built my channel slowly. I have not went crazy trying to get subs. I've got good people that watch my stuff. Not a ton of them. But there's, there's, there's a nice handful. <clears throat> and um, every one of you that's watching, well, most of you anyway, I appreciate you. But yeah, I think that people, I think that people kind of uh, take advantage of me. Um, some people, of course, because I don't. I try not to feed into the drama. I try to stay out of it. Now I've been livid for the past week <clears throat> about a couple of situations, um, and I'm over most of it. Um, but there's there's one there's still one one situation that I have to confront, <clears throat> and uh, that'll be that. And when the next one comes, I'll deal with it then. So. My tolerance is low. It's a hot pepper. It's real oily, too. If you guys can see, you guys can't see in there. Not the best tasting pepper, of course, but. <clears throat> I know it didn't cross pollinate because these were seeds that I saved out of a pepper last year. Um, I gave one of the plants to somebody and it's throwing the peach colored pod so um, mine just threw a different color variation which has happened quite a bit this year with me <clears throat> very surprised and, uh, and I've had color variations thrown with isolated seeds also uh, which I absolutely love I love getting new color variations um, even if something reverts back or something man I just absolutely love it I'll just Embrace it and, you know, I think it's just completely awesome. <clears throat> and you only see it with, you know, one out of every 10 plants, sometimes one out of every 20 plants, stuff like that. So, by the way, these are peppers. These are my daughter's peppers. Um, I don't know what the name of this is. No, they're not Fresnos. <clears throat> if someone said the name, I might remember it. I actually threw the tag away. I don't know why. But uh, it was something I never heard of. And I thought that they ripened green. So I ate one, gave my daughter one. She ate it. And then they ripened red after a while. And so I gave her one. And it was so funny. I was in the shower. And all of a sudden I heard her scream. She came running in there and stuck her hand in through the curtain like this. She goes, Daddy, it's hot. <clears throat> I go, no, it's not. And I took it and I ate it while I was in the shower. And I was like. All right, yeah, it's got a little burn, so yeah, it's got a little, little, maybe the same or a little bit more than a good jalapeno, you know, not the fake jalapenos that taste like a green pepper. So, <clears throat> waking up with the bull in the morning. Yeah, man, just having my breakfast. Uh, I run the post office, water my plants, 
I'm supposed to be making hot sauce today, but we'll see. Don't know if that's going to happen or not. But how are you doing out there, YouTube world? Comment below what you're up to today. How's your day going? Just talk, talk crap to me if you want to. I love you guys. Thank you for turning in, Tanner Boy, in the morning.